I just went on the worst second date I've ever been on. So, okay, second date. I went on a first date with him last week. It went really well. He, like, we went for drinks, and then we went to the park, and then we walked his dog, and we ate pizza, and it was great. And then, so he asks me to go out again tonight. We we're supposed to go for, um... Well, he wanted to go on, a, like, something, like, more elaborate, but I was really tired this week, so I was like, can we do something chill? So, um, we were supposed to go on a walk and a picnic, and, um, I, like, 6.30 at night and watch, like, the sunset, like, that was his idea, and I get to his place, um, where we're gonna walk from, and he's like, so, like, my friend is having, um, is in this tournament for Br Brazilian <laughs> jiu-jitsu, and he's, like, fighting in it, um, do you want to go watch him? And I'm like, in my head, I'm like, no, but I didn't know how to say no, <laughs> so I said yes, but I'm thinking, like, it's okay, it's probably not that long, and, like, we'll probably go do something after, um, so we get there, and he pays $45 for the both of us, and I'm sitting there, and, like, his friends keep showing up, um, so it's, like, me, and, like, him, and then, like, three of his friends, and, um, like, I introduce myself, but, like, it's weird, um, and then, like, I don't know why. I'm just, like, feeling, like, panicky at this point. Like, I'm uncomfortable. And I'm, like, so, like, how long is this? And he's, like, oh, I think it's supposed to go till 10. And I'm, like, till 10? <laughs> I, I straight say, I was, like, I'm, I'm not staying till 10. Like, I, I can't. I can't stay here till 10. And then, um, at this point, I'm, like, not feeling good. And, like, I'm about to cry. And, like, I don't know why I'm about to cry. But, like, that's what I was feeling. I just, like, I was feeling anxious. I was feeling uncomfortable. So I tell him I'm going to go to the bathroom. So I go to the bathroom. I call my best friend. I start crying on the phone. And then she, like, helps me with my anxiety. And then I go back in. And I'm like, it's okay. We're probably going to do something after. It's fine. So I sit down. I'm talking to him. And I'm like, so, like, can we go to, like, my favorite restaurant after this? Like, it's just it's not very far. And he's like, oh, um, I kind of, like, told the guys that I would go to the gym with them at 10 p.m. So I'm like, you're going to go to the gym tonight at 10 p.m.? Like, after this and he's like yeah like they just added me to the group chat and like i have to go like i just committed to it you committed to it <laughs> like you committed to our first our second date at this point it is 8 p.m i'm not staying there for two hours for me to leave by myself and him go to the fucking gym this man is 31 by the way i finally get up the courage to tell him like at 805 to tell him that like i'm leaving um, so I'm like, hey, you know what, like, I'm gonna go home now, and, um, he's like, oh, are you sure, like, can you stay and watch my friend fight, and I'm like, oh, like, when, when's he going, he's like, oh, there's, like, seven people ahead of him, and I'm just like, no, like, I'm, I'm gonna go now, and I'm telling him this, holding back tears, I don't know if he's stupid, he just couldn't tell, but, like, I'm, like, trying not to cry, I'm telling him that, like, I'm leaving, yeah, it's 8.27, he hasn't texted me or anything, he's still there, I go to my friend's house, <laughs> that was horrible, <laughs>